Hi and welcome back to the channel. Well, we're going to be looking at the outlook for the next four weeks, which is taking us up to the very nearly the end of December. I'm using two models, the JMA from Japan and the ECMWF European model. So let's dive in and find out what they think. Week 1, 28th of November to the 4th of December. Low pressure firmly in control over the UK weather, bringing temperatures around average with slightly below average temperatures up in Scotland. Rainfall is just slightly above average. Looking at the ECMWF, slightly different in the date. This is the 1st of December to the 8th, so just a couple of days extended from the JMA. Definitely got the low pressure in control there in the same location as the JMA We've got temperatures around average for Scotland and uh, one to two degrees above average for Northern England, Wales and the rest of the UK. Northern Ireland is around average. Rainfall, top of Scotland around average. Southern Scotland and Northern England slightly above average and quite a bit above average rainfall for Wales the Midlands, South West and South East. So comparing the two models, you've got the temperature on the top, they've got it around average. The only around average is for Scotland and above average for the rest of the UK. Rainfall is a, a slightly above average rainfall for both. So it's pretty close, so we'll both give them a tick. 5th to the 11th of December, low pressure is still over the UK. This is bringing temperatures around average and above average rainfall for the UK. Let's have a look at the ECMWF model. 8th to the 15th of December, low pressure still over the UK and this is bringing temperatures um, slightly above average for all of the UK and rainfall slightly above average rainfall. So looking at the comparisons there, the JMA is going for temperatures around average where the ECMWF model is going for above average temperatures. Rainfall for both is a slightly above average rainfall. So I think we can give them a tick there. This is a two week period from the JMA. So it's taking us from the 12th to December the 25th. So it's a two week period. So there's a bit of a change over in the two weeks. But overall, they're taking with low pressure on the west side of the country and slack air pressure on the east side of the country. This is going to bring temperatures around average. So quite a cool feel, I would think but they've still got it slightly above average rainfall. So the third week from the ECMWF, the 15th to the 22nd, still low pressure there. Look, over the UK with slack air pressure over the North Sea and Scandinavia. They're bringing uh, temperatures for most of the UK around average with slightly above average on the northeast side, on the east side of the country. And rainfall is around average. So the comparisons there, fairly close on the comparisons around average. And uh, the JMA are thinking it's going to be a bit wetter than the ECMWF think. So looking at week four, which is the 22nd to the 29th, Low pressure over the UK, bringing temperatures around average with slightly above average temperatures on the east coast and rainfall is around average. So comparing the two models, um, we've got average temperatures and the JMA think it's slightly above average rainfall where the ECMWF think it's around average rainfall. So I think... We've got a fair amount of agreement there. I do hope you found that interesting. It may not be what you want if you wanted a white Christmas, but that's what it's looking like at the moment. Not too far out, the two models, really. Uh, so at the moment, I do not see any prolonged cold spell. Yes, towards the end of the month, 
around Christmas time onwards, it's looking temperatures around about what you'd expect. Anyway, do keep in touch by watching the channel and do leave that comment below. And if you've enjoyed this video, do give me a great big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I would really appreciate that. Until we meet again, look after yourselves and those you love. BFN, bye for now.